Tremper Longman III's book, How to Read the Psalms, offers a profound exploration of the Book of Psalms, a collection of religious poetry and hymns that holds a significant place in both Jewish and Christian traditions. Through meticulous analysis, Longman provides readers with valuable insights into the nature, structure, and interpretation of the Psalms, emphasizing their enduring relevance in contemporary spiritual life. Longman begins by elucidating the historical and cultural context of the Psalms, recognizing their origins as a response to the human experience and the divine. The Psalms are not just timeless prayers and songs but also serve as a reflection of the human condition in the context of faith. Understanding the context in which they were written, such as the reign of King David and the exile in Babylon, is pivotal to grasping their significance. This historical backdrop helps readers appreciate the depth and diversity within the Psalms, which include cries of despair, expressions of joy, and prayers for guidance. Central to Longman's analysis is the classification of Psalms into different genres. He introduces categories like lament, thanksgiving, wisdom, and royal psalms, each having distinct structures and thematic elements. By identifying these genres, Longman equips readers with tools for better comprehension and interpretation of individual psalms. He emphasizes the necessity of recognizing these genres and their conventions to appreciate the original intent of the psalmists. Furthermore, Longman addresses the issue of imprecatory psalms, which contain harsh language and calls for divine vengeance upon enemies. He suggests that these psalms are often misunderstood and should be read in the context of the Hebrew Bible's theology. These psalms express the profound moral and spiritual struggle that arises when individuals perceive themselves as victims of injustice. Longman encourages readers to see these psalms as an honest expression of human emotions rather than as a prescription for vengeance. He advocates for reading them as part of a larger theological conversation within the Bible. Longman's book also delves into the literary aspects of the psalms. He elucidates their use of metaphors, parallelism, and acrostic forms, which contribute to their poetic beauty and complexity. The Psalms employ vivid imagery to convey deep emotions and theological truths, allowing readers to engage with them on both intellectual and emotional levels. Longman particularly emphasizes the significance of parallelism, which is the repetition and variation of ideas within the lines of the Psalm. This feature allows for a more profound exploration of the text, as it encourages readers to reflect on the nuances of the psalmist's message. In addition to the literary aspects, Longman explores the theological dimensions of the psalms. He argues that the psalms contain both individual and communal dimensions of faith, as they express the beliefs and experiences of both the individual psalmist and the larger community of faith. This duality mirrors the personal and collective nature of faith itself. The Psalms reflect the tension between individual experience and the broader community of faith, presenting a rich tapestry of human-divine relationships. Longman also discusses the messianic interpretations of the Psalms, noting how many Christians view certain Psalms as prophetic references to Jesus Christ. While recognizing the importance of these interpretations, he stresses that the primary function of the Psalms is to express the human-divine relationship in their original context. Understanding their historical and cultural context, he argues, is crucial for a more accurate interpretation. Throughout the book, Longman emphasizes the dynamic nature of the Psalms, which allows them to continue speaking to contemporary readers. He underscores that the Psalms are not confined to historical or theological archives but remain relevant in the lives of believers today. They provide a language for expressing a wide range of human emotions, fostering a deeper connection with God and facilitating spiritual growth. In conclusion, 
Tremper Longman III's How to Read the Psalms is a comprehensive literary analysis of the Book of Psalms that illuminates the historical, theological, and literary dimensions of this ancient collection of prayers and songs. Longman's insights into the context, genre, and structure of the Psalms equip readers with the tools to engage with these sacred texts more deeply. By emphasizing the enduring relevance of the Psalms, Longman invites contemporary readers to explore and apply the wisdom, beauty, and spirituality found within these ancient verses. His book serves as a valuable resource for both scholars and lay readers seeking a richer understanding of the Psalms and their enduring significance in the realm of faith and spirituality.